Hello, thank you for joining this video. Here we'd like to explore the About Us page or Our Story page in your Shopify store. So I would like to begin with uh, our demo store, uh, our game theme in the theme style Mio. This is the first example that we'd like to show you. Uh, so in here, when we hover on the About section in the menu, as you can see, we can click here and go to the Our Story page. So first of all, it begins with this banner with image and text. Next, we get this um, text section as well. And then, as you can see, we have also images, we have text, we have uh, links, we have our members team um, section. And as you can see, more and more information about the products, about the brand and the products themselves. So next, uh, we have this example for the must have theme style. When we also hover on about, we can go to info and about must have. And here, once again, as you can see, we get some examples of the products, some information about the store. We also have the locations and also featured collection. There are actually several ways of how you can customize your own About Us page. Uh, so now let's get to it. So first of all, we go to our Shopify admin panel. And we, first of all, of course, need to create the actual page. So we go to online store here and then we go to pages. Now we need to click on add page to actually create our page. So let's give it a name. You can, of course, name it our story about us as you please. Let me just name it our story. And then in the content here, we can choose uh, to add the information, the text information in the content or in the theme customizer. So first of all, let me show you the example um, when we add the content in here. So let me just paste some content in here. We need to make these sections bold like this. And next. Uh, we need to choose the visibility. So for example, if you're creating the page and you want to publish it right away, then of course choose the, um, the status visible. But for example, if you want to just create the page and you want to continue maybe editing, customizing it, and you don't want to publish it yet, then just simply choose the uh, status hidden. If you choose hidden, then your page will be created. It will stay in your Shopify admin panel. It's just that it will not be live on your store. So for our example, let's choose visible so that we can see the example. And next we need to choose the template. So there are actually several templates. Um, first of all is the default page. So by choosing the default page template, it means that any changes that you do in here, so in this content field, they will reflect on your store. However, if we choose our story template, then all the customization, all the editing, the texts, the images should be done in the theme customizer. So for this example, when we choose default page, we can actually add anything that we want in here. So you can also, of course, insert tables, you can add images, videos, you can insert your HTML code, you can totally modify your uh, text content here. So for example, let's just simply add the image. We just click uh, click on insert image. Here are several of our images, but we can choose to like show the product images. So let's choose this one. Uh, we can also change the size and let's click on insert image. And now, as you can see, we have our image in here. So by choosing the default page, uh, this will mean that when we go to view our store, uh, we will see only this content that we add in here. So let's click on save. Here is our page. And now let's click on view page. So as you can see, now we're on our store. We have these breadcrumbs that says we are in our store page, our story page. And here is the content that we've just added, the product and the um, the content of the text that we've added before. And if we go to our theme customizer, we go to pages. And uh, then if we go to our story here, uh, as you can see, it's not assigned to any page. So it says our story assigned to zero pages. So this is why uh, we will now go to our admin panel. And in here, we will change uh, the theme template from default page to our story. Now let's save our changes. And now when we once again go to view page, 
as you can see we now have several of these sections so we have this banner with the text section we have this rich text section we have also uh, these where we can add the image and the text and several of these sections we can also add videos so even though we have this content in here we have the text we have the image we do not see it on our story page actually because we've just changed the template to our story and to modify our page now we simply need to go to our theme customizer we need to go to pages and our story and once we refresh the page as you can see we now have a page so it doesn't say that assigned to zero we now have one page that this template is assigned to and it is our story page and from here we can start the customization so let's just refresh the page once again and now as you can see we have this template section and we have this banner with text section we have rich text section we have three image with text we have our team video featured collection so you can add all of this in here if you do not need all of these sections in your our story page you can choose to either click on them and click to remove section or you can just simply hide it for example uh, and as you can see we used to have three image with text we deleted one and we've hidden one and now we are only left with one image with text section here and the same goes to other sections if you want to hide them you can just easily do it by clicking here for example or just going in here and click on remove the section uh, so next as you can see all of uh, the customization should be done within this um, within your theme customizer so if we go to rich text here as you can see we can add um, like our story for example we can add the uh, subheading and now only in here we can add the text so let's also add the text that we've used to have we can also make uh, some of the words some of the parts bold we can also add links so for example uh, you can add a link maybe to your collection or to anything else uh, maybe to any other of your pages or even to external pages so for example let me add uh, the text here uh, follow us on youtube and I can now actually link this text so as you can see we get this follow us on youtube we can just uh, highlight it click on insert link and if you want to add an internal link then just simply click here and choose one of the internal links but for external link just copy the link itself and here as you can see that for external links HTTP or HTTPS is required so fully enter your link URL then click here and we can also choose to open the link in the new window and now let's click on insert and now we have a link in here we can also choose the alignment uh, and we actually have a separate video on how to set up the rich text section we will of course link this video uh, in the description box of this one so feel free to check it uh, and this is it so this is how you uh, create the our story page and two ways of how you can customize it in the Shopify admin panel by choosing default page template or by choosing our story template and customizing it in your theme customizer from here. So now let's save our changes. Even though we didn't add many of these sections in here, let's just simply uh, go to view page from here. And now, as you can see, we have this rich text section filled out. We have all of this uh, content. We have our link. And this is it. If you have any questions, feel free to contact our support team. We are always here to help you. And don't forget about our theme menu, where you can also find all of this information in here. Thank you very much for your time. Take care. Bye.